Good afternoon. Good morning. Hope you are. I'm Tame Cat, and today we're going to be doing a uh, uh, best way to put it is it's Sully, aka the Handsome. So, for my day, that's off it. So, um, it has got virtually no armor at all in the um, even a Italian. It does take 30 minutes, 13, 3, 3, one, one way. Basically, um, the reason why it says first part, regular, third bomber, second part, grand attacker, is because of WoW. Um, as well, as well, um, just a tiny number of people on there, so it's going to be over quick. So, I just basically get myself going, just stay up and think of the starting performance of the ball. <sighs> yeah, it's, it's good aircraft. It's good aircraft. It's got a decent bomb load and rockets as well. But it does because it's got no armor. The one thing it's got is zero armor. So, yeah. Yeah, it's basically a standard bombing. Basically, pretty much. Place and showing I'm pretty good with my bombs, where it's a conventional bomber. And at which point, I should be sure it's basically sure if that works. Then we just head for home. So, yeah, it's, it's a good aircraft. It's worth 400, it's 800 more. I don't know what it is, but the point is, it's worth your gold. Especially if you're using history. So, a bit about my skin. So, the skin I've got is the only I can see it gets a Water from the Live skin. Without everyone else, I just see the regular standard Hudson. So, yeah. The, one, the bit about this is that it's an aircraft that um, was damaged during uh, the Battle of Malaya. So, yeah, it's just a bit of history. See, I'm starting it right down as you can observe. My landing technique. <laughs> yeah, like you can see, how does he land a bomber or something? How do you land a plane such as the Hydra 718 or twin engine bomber? It's mediocre and mediocre. So, yeah, it's entirely unconventional. I don't know why it's hilarious, but it's delicious. That basically dodged the B 18. It's really his viewpoint. Yeah, I'm there. Literally making me like the eighties on right down. So going to steam so I get a tenery train disaster or something, but yeah, but that was very, very close. It was a bit too close. And then basically this guy put how oh, you learn something. I put it set the fur bullet and bomber. So I guess the thing you need to do in a bomber is you need to stay out of the fur ball. So yeah, that was close. Way too close. It's very, very close. Yeah, it was mostly it was like sparks. <laughs> I mean, it was mediocre landing, but I don't know. The best way to put it was it was an airless landing. So, yeah, it, overall it's a good aircraft, but it's defensive is alright, it's lacking in its terms of. Armour is non existent, it's worth it if you have a high altitude, and it's helpful if you've got allies that are like you've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 people, 9v9, when there's barely anyone else because everyone's focused on dogfighting. So, this is part two of why I'm trying to do what ground attack, but this is where the aircraft shines. It's a decent ground attack, but it's not really worth it. If you, if you want to go ground attack, then yeah, it's. Better off getting um, something like either Havoc or Boston. Boston is a reality market. You're much better off getting if you like some ground tank that's decent with a bit of protection, get the Havoc. That's how they do 
Yes, I am. No, I'm not. No, I am. Yes, this guy sucks. Think it's funny to try and shoot me. It's only in jest because we won. Uh, basically, that was pretty much it. So, it's just, I don't know, to sum it up, it's got decent maneuverability. Yeah, I was actually playing on the US tank line with back in the Hudson. So, it's got rockets, it's got pretty decent stuff to base with one. You can one shot bases if you dump the entire bomb load. So, the thing is, it's got zero armor, which is very easy to kill the pilot and kind of navigate the bombardier. It's very easy to kill. You want to go for Hudson? Unless you want to taste the two guns in front, let's just try and go for a side shot or lower belly shot. That's my impression, because I'm actually really coming against them. But that's a story for another day. So please like, share and subscribe. I'll see you 